do me a huge favor and in the comments down below leave me a video topic or subjects or maybe even questions you guys want me to cover with Rebecca or as you guys may know her Rokora because me and her are going to be doing a video this Friday and maybe perhaps Sunday. I don't know about Sunday but I know Friday for sure. So make sure you leave those comments, questions, or even video topics down below. But anyways guys, I got an extremely, extremely good gameplay for you guys today. And it is a 91 and 0 flawless. This is my highest flawless to date. It is pretty amazing. And I am using the killstreak setup VSAT Lodestar Dogs, which is normally the killstreak setup I would use 99% of the time. But honestly, if I was using Lodestar Dog Swarm, which is my 100 plus kill game uh, killstreak setup, I would have hit 100 plus flawless, no doubt about it. But then, actually, probably made it, might have died once or twice because the load star is kind of a higher kill streak than a VSAT is. But for the class setup, I am using the PDW Silencer Extended Mags with, I believe, Ghost, Hardline, Scavenger, Dexterity, C4, and Concussion. If there is no C4 or Concussion on this class, I usually run, um, what is it? Ghost, Hardline, Scavenger, Focus, and then Dexterity. That is my extreme tryhard class, where I just don't throw on a C4 or a Concussion Grenade. But um, anyways, so that's it for the gameplay, and I just want to talk a little bit about why I don't post 100 plus kill games on daily like most of these YouTubers do. First of all, I just want to say, it's not that I can't get 100 pluses. I can't. Maybe not, you know, 100 plus, 100 plus kill games kill streak list, meaning... I can't drop a 100 plus kill game without kill streaks, and there's a lot of people that can't. It's really hard. It's extremely hard to do that, for that matter. And if I want to drop a 100 plus, I usually run load star dogs and swarm. But the reason I can't, okay, put it this way, I have only dropped, I would say, 11 or 12 100 plus kill games. The main reason I've only dropped that many is because I play 6v6, not 9v9. And a lot of you guys are going to be like, oh, there's no difference in that. 6v6 is just as easy as 9v9. You should get bitch slapped across the face if you think it's just as easy to drop a 100 plus kill game in 6v6 as it is 9v9. Trust me, I know. Because out of those 14 or 15 or whatever I said, um, 100 pluses I've gotten, few of them have actually come from ground war because honestly ground war is so much easier there is so many more kids in there bad players for that matter and you get nine or six seven eight nine you get three more people to kill instead of just six so if you put it this way if you could drop a hundred plus kill game in 6v6 you could drop a hundred plus kill game in ground war no fucking doubt about it like it's just plain fucking mathematics and I was good in high school and when it came to math, you know, I was I was a math genius. Not to brag or toot my own horn, but math was my strongest subject. I love math. I loved the math since I was a kid. So obviously I know what the fuck I'm talking about. <laughs> I got I got a little bit much into that. But anyways, um yeah, that is the main reason I can't drop 100 plus kill games on the daily like most of these YouTubers. But I am gonna try to get into ground war because I do see that Ground War gives me possibilities to drop these amazing gameplays that you guys would be entertained by and that I could grow from and get more views from. Obviously, you know, I want views, so I'm a YouTuber, what YouTuber doesn't want views for fuck's sake. But anyways guys, that's it for the gameplay or for the commentary for today. And that might sound weird because I kind of cut my voice. But anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you hit that like down below and subscribe, obviously, if you're new. And leave those comments down below on what you want me and Rebecca or me and Rekora to cover in the next video we do together. You know, it could be a question, it could be a video topic that you want us to cover, whatever you guys want. But here's two videos you guys might have missed. On one side, we got a PDW gameplay where most of my kill streaks do pretty much all the work in that gameplay. And on the right, we got a Vector gameplay where I ended up going 91 and 3. It's a really decent gameplay. I rushed extremely hard. Um, my kill streaks didn't really do as much work as they normally do on most of my videos. But anyways, guys, my name is Jordan or JDM Brothers, and I'm out. Peace.